when you're writing a character like Jasmine, did you have a performer like Kate Blanchett in mind? This time I did. Um, I, I had hoped it would be Kate. I didn't know if we could get her. I had always had um, a, a director's crush on Kate. Uh, years ago... It's not just you. you know, no, we, all, we all have a crush on her. Yeah, I, I was just... There was a lot of talk around, if you recall, when um, Mr. Ripley came out, right. the movie, how terrific the movie was and how tremendous the, uh, Damon was, Matt Damon. And, and so I went to see the movie. And yes, he, he was great and the people in it were great. Uh, but I kept saying, who is that girl? You know, she's fantastic. Every time she's on the screen, it just lights up. And they said, uh, Australian, Kate Blanchett. And I saw a few other movies of hers over the years. And I, all, I didn't see her play Streetcar uh, because I never go to see that because I, I don't think it can be done better than the existing version. And it breaks my heart to see it without Marlon Brando or Vivian Leigh. I just can't do it. So... I saw her in a few movies, and I, I thought, God, she's one of the greatest actresses I've ever seen. <laughs> and, and, I, and so when I was writing it, I thought to myself, yeah, you know, a, a woman in her early 40s, you know, Kate Blanchett, sure, but what are the odds I could get her? And she was just finishing, I was so lucky, Chekhov, uh, she was touring with... Uh, a Chekhov play. Uncle Vanya. Uncle Vanya, was it? And she had a commitment with, um, I think it was, it was either Isabel Huppert or, or, or the other one. Uh, it was Isabel Huppert. Was it Isabel Huppert? Yeah. To do uh, a Jean Genet play. Mm -hmm. and, um, and her fallow period lay right when I was shooting. I'm surprised to, uh, so it's based on their availability, because I'm actually a little surprised to hear you say that you were wondering if you could get her, don't you? I mean, aren't most actors wanting to work with you? That's a myth. <laughs> you know, it's a good myth, uh, and I, I, but it's a myth. They have to be not doing anything at the time, because we, we can pay, we pay the union minimum. So, um, you know, if they're offered, you know, $5 million or $10 million, they're not going to do my film, n no matter what they think of me. I mean, you know, it's too big a, s a thing. And, uh, you know, th uh, there have been many times when um, we send a script and an actor, an actress. Uh, I was turned down like three times by Sean Penn before he finally accepted a movie of mine. Um, and we get turned down, you know, n not a tremendous amount of time, but definitely, you know, a definite percentage. And so, uh, you know, I, I just didn't know. Uh, first of all, I didn't know if she'd be available. And that, that's always a turn down automatically. But so, uh, you know, and I didn't know would she want to do it or... And she did. And I was very, you know, it's like the day she finished the Chekhov play, she raced out to uh, San Francisco and started with us the next day. I mean, it was so close. Fortunately, I don't rehearse. I never rehearse. So she could finish that. And she was game for it. She was not one of those people that said, well, I, I need two weeks of rehearsal. And she just came in and did it. You know, one of the reasons that, um, that the, the picture has worked with people is really Kate's natural... Charisma or whatever it is she has, people maybe with another actress or a lesser actress would just hate the character and would just feel, hey, she's rich and uh, I really don't care what happens to her. But for some, there's something built into Kate herself that's nothing that I wrote that that's just there with her that she, you know, where audiences feel for Kate. She, the way she cries, the way she uh, gets exasperated or loses it, uh, you know. And maybe with, a, with another actress who, who where you don't see all the complexity reading on the screen, maybe you think, you know, I just know I was lucky to get her. And there are not many actresses 
in the world that have that kind of depth. Uh, certainly not her age either. I mean, you know, yes, Meryl Streep is a great, great actress, and but she's much older than, uh, than that. Uh, you know, but, but there are not many who can really do that. And Kate is, you know, has a, a likable... You know, Kate's very funny. She was funny in the Mr. Ripley picture, and mm. she, she, you know, she would be wonderful in a comedy because she's, she's a funny lady.